So apparently Shane Gillis isn't just a comedian. He's also a part-time fortune teller. Because <laughs> uh, he predicted Drake's downfall five years ago is what they say. And I don't know why this video started with DJ Academics, but let's get right into it. Make sure you join that Patreon for the exclusives. Here. Um, Shane. Shane Gillis. Yes, he has yes. a podcast. Hilarious, yes. There's a clip. New show out on uh, Netflix, Tires. Go watch Oh, yeah, Tires. the premiere is doing it. There's a, I there's a 2019, yeah. I guess he does a podcast. He had 2019, him and his guy, uh, who's his co host, I guess, are on the podcast, and he randomly comes out. You know, Aaron already dug it up. Randomly in 2019, he comes out. They're talking about Epstein, then R. Kelly, and he says, he says I'm going to just say this right now. In five years, they're getting Drake. And, like, he kind of, like, is. Oh, I don't even want to do the math. Somebody in the comment section tell me, was it exactly five years later? I don't want to do the math. But if it was exactly five years later, I'm going to look at Shane Gillis a little different. Hmm? Those little hmm? Hmm? faces he makes. I'm going to look behind those menacing looks like, what does he know? What else does Shane know? It's not even like a joke where it's like, ah, it, he, like he starts to kind of, he's like, yo, that's the word out about this guy. And that that made me a little bit uneasy because I was like. Because the two white guys from rural Pennsylvania. <laughs> no, no, I was just like, yo, about I was like, hip -hop that you don't know. No, no, no. no <laughs> this is just... the thing about narratives. It's like. <laughs> Andrew, shut up, bro. That's not what he was saying. <laughs> that's not what he was saying, nigga. He's saying that this nigga, it wasn't that he's a rural white guy that knows something about hip hop, is that he knows something that no, it wouldn't matter if it was hip hop. This would be like predicting the Epstein shit five years before it happened. Like, why did he take it as a, a shot to his whiteness? You know how far you got to grasp at straws? Well, that's what people dug up. For, for, like, that, that for the two whitest off. human beings on the planet <laughs> to tell you something about a hip hop star that you speak to regularly? Yeah, but I don't know these people's personal lives. I really wouldn't know. I think about uh, Epstein definitely right, going to be like, suicided here shortly. With the fact that they found him, like, dude, first of all, he's, first wait, he's wait. Be suicide. was this before Epstein? Self deleted? Hold on. Hold on. Hold the, hold the phone. Hold the phone. Because if this is before, if he predicted Epstein getting out of here, which I think a lot of people did, I feel like. That's a little bit more creepy with the Drake thing, and I feel like niggas is kind of burying the lead with the Drake thing. That's what? With the fact that they found him, like, dude, first of all, he's, first of he's all, about to get suicide. First of all, R. So Kelly's hard. missing, dude. <laughs> what the fuck what? is going on? R. Kelly's missing. Kells is missing? Kells is missing, dude. He was, he con aired and he got away. What? Yeah, dude. R. Kelly got away. That reminds me, I do want to say this. I want to be on the record. Drake, sure. Drake's going to be, he's on that R. Kelly tip. Do you think so? Drizzy Drake likes him young. What? He does. That's somewhat known already, but it, this is one of those things where I want to, you know, you got to say something. Like, remember Louis, that whole thing? Yeah. And, like, we knew about that. Yeah. And we were just like, I don't know. L Drake, Drizzy Drake's into the young ones. He's I mean, going to get got in the next five years. Oh. Unfortunately. Love me some Drizzy Drake. 2019, 2020. Yeah, I'm doing that in my hand. 2021, 22. 23, 24. Shane, Shane Gillis is officially the devil. And ain't nobody gonna... Ain't nobody gonna tell me different, bro. Nah, nigga. Right, dude. Down to the year? Nah, nigga. Nah. Shane Gillis and, and Kendrick were in cahoots. I'm telling you. Dude. I drunk texted uh, Birdman. <laughs> I was fucked up. He gave you the gossip? Then he hit me the, what's up, homeboy, the next day. I haven't had the heart to reply. So, so you're getting good info that he's fucking... Dude, Birdman did not supply him with that info. Mm -hmm. It's just a separate story. Separate breaking Oh, never news. accused the Birdman. Separate of on the ticker. Also on the ticker. <laughs> oh, he's, he's talking <laughs> drunk, drunk texted Birdman. He replied. I didn't reply because I'm ashamed. What? Yeah, bro. Trump texted the Birdman? <laughs> no. <laughs> I did. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck's going on? Drunk texted. Oh, I got gotcha, hammered gotcha, and gotcha. I was like, dude, let's see if Birdman will FaceTime us. Oh, that's so fucking funny. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Damn, dude! I can't so believe I fucking chipped a tooth. Though. You're calling for people to fight. You're calling for people to take him down, dude. Drizzy Drake? Yeah. Nah, I love Drake. Really? I hate to see him. You I, would defend. I like Drake. Better ass. But how young? I don't think he's a pedophile. He just, just like, likes young girls. Okay, how young? Again. Post pedophile, like <laughs> seventeen. Ah, dude, that that's the crazy post. -pe nah, that's the craziest term I've ever heard in life. Post pedophile? Nah, nigga. No. 
Another thing is, I did not know Shane Gillis was so connected to hip hop. It's weird because I've seen Shane Gillis stuff where I go like, dang, Shane Gillis seems to be a lot more tapped into hip hop than his counterparts. Like than the like the I don't even know if the Joe Rogan crowd is his crowd. But he seems like particularly tapped in. There's certain references he makes and certain things he says where I go, nah, this nigga loves hip hop. This nigga like loves hip hop. Like 17. Ah, dude, that's called a pedophile. Bro. Like no, it's not. It's at least, like it's not a pedophile. <laughs> pedophile is like pre pubescent. Pedophile is okay. Yeah, you got the guy with that itch. You don't think he's think maybe he's on, going to Thailand and being like, Kells. whoa, I didn't know. I think he's on that Kells tip. The Kells one's like 13, 12. All right. Well, that's a little young. Kells dated Aaliyah, bro. Uh, yeah, Kells, Kells is, is a little is a, young. A you, are you, you're pedophile. telling me Drake is fucking JoJo Siwa? <laughs> I think Drake is <laughs> JoJo what? Siwa is like an eight-year-old pop sensation. <laughs> um, I, think he likes, I think Drizzy Drake likes some young. Youngsters. Right around that. So you're allowed to fucking seven? What's the point of 18? Why does everyone... I just picked that. Does he you think he like does his tour and like how? I think they, they had like screenshots of him coming like, back to Texas again. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. A very specific date. Yeah, dude. Oh, it's just well, we, like Texas. Is, I birthday. think Texas sixteen is Texas like, is young, dude. Yeah, Texas is like whatever. I'm young down there. Speaking <laughs> of, I'll be in Texas at the end of this month. Any seventeen year olds want to come out to my shows? So, dude, that's fucking crazy. Yeah, I have a good theory on Jersey Drake. He's getting brought brought down, bro. You think so? No doubt. That's a, that's gonna know? be a big one. It's gonna oh. be a sad day, dude. You think so? I'm gonna be yeah. sad on that one. I mean, if he goes a full R. Kelly route, I think he's going. You think going R. Kelly Kels. disappeared and talked to Jersey? Yeah, he I think, vanished, dude. He vanished. R. Kelly evaded the authorities. Kells is gonna be like you know at the end of Star Wars when. That's a prediction where y'all got wrong for sure. <laughs> y'all for sure got that one wrong. <laughs> That nigga didn't evade shit. <laughs> wow, though. What else do you know? I want to see what I want to see Shane Gill's follow up on this. He has to have a follow up on this. Put in the comments section. Does he have a follow up to this? Don't tell me what he says. And do y'all want me to react to it? Flood the comment section up with that. Luke <laughs> sees those ghosts. Drake's gonna be at a concert, and there's gonna be like a hologram Cosby, a hologram fucking Kells, Jackson. Louis will be jerking off as sure. a ghost. Jackson too. Jackson will be in there. Just like, oh. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Yeah, J Drizzy's gonna. <sighs> no, nah, the police went after Jackson. They went through all his stuff, and they ain't find the stuff. Jackson had his the difference between everybody else you named, besides Drake. Yeah, because you know, tell on them. All of them, the mother people, were put to the flame, and got burnt. Which means we found out the truth. Hmm? Louis came out and admitted it. Got down, uh, 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 R. Kelly. Come on, nigga. He literally had a videotape. Michael was not. Come on now. Stop it. I don't know. Do you have any other pedophiles, you think? No, I don't, dude. I don't. I don't. I Do mean, you have anybody you'd like to allege? Uh, like to allege. No, man. I, I can't think of anyone that thinks a pedophile besides Drake. Now I'm pretty <laughs> fucking sure about that, but. He has a song with, I don't know, he has like songs that people think are about, there's this chick named Georgia, I forget how fucking young Georgia she said. is. Well, he married a how porn star. Or not he married, he, he, didn't he, he like... He impregnated like a stripper or a porn star, yeah. There was he a was French a porn that star, That's, yeah, that was the one they made fun of him for, the Pusha Key made fun of him for. So. So this chick's 22, she was born in 97, and Drake was, Drake was like... In like 16, so like four years ago, he was talking to her. Wait, what? She's 22 now. <clears throat> he was talking to her four she years She just ago? turned 22. He was talking to her, yeah, they had like a song together <sighs> in, in 2016. I, dude, I think also, too, he came up in like child star stuff. So I think it's like, you come up under a different world with that shit. Yeah, he had... It's like, dude, if you're a child star, you definitely have like 30-year-old ladies blowing you and shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, if you're a celebrity and a kid... That's celebrity mojo. Like, what? a girl's not going to not suck your dick because you're, like, 14. Yeah. She's done it. She's going to do it. So. Damn. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, definitely getting hit. He's had some weird experiences. For child sure. star. Yeah, you, you got to remember that. Corey Fell. All those dudes. He man. is coming off child star. Now, all of a sudden, he's, like, a hardcore rapper. Which is, yeah. Post-child. Yeah. Post-child star. Weird times. Drake's got to be going through a lot of weird. Yeah, you really don't think about how fucked up and weird that guy must be.
I mean, dude, it's got to be. Meanwhile, Kanye West is still the best. Killing it. Kanye dude. came up traditional as far as rappers are concerned. Yeah. You know, Chicago, gang, yeah, gangland, nice. all that. Yep. Now he's retarded. He got yeah. hit with the bug. <laughs> he got bit bad. <laughs> Yeah, um, but the child star shit's out of this world. So yeah, yeah. if you're a child star, you're guaranteed. <laughs> you might have got head too young, dude. That can happen if you get. I mean, that's. I mean, yeah, that's actually. That's like getting sexually assaulted as a youth, and mm. uh, yeah, that so leads to child some star bad getting behavior. Head too young. Yeah. Leads to you doing collabs. With. I can't believe what I'm hearing, nigga. This is. I almost feel like I he I heard a lot of people talking about this, but not enough. Not enough. Not with the, the literal year prediction he made. Yeah. Hot 17-year-olds. Yeah. And then he had like a diss track about her <laughs> on the next CD. Really? He was like, you could have been something. I could have made you. I could have molded you into something great. He never names who it is, but everyone's like, that's who it's about for sure. What? Yeah, some hot-ass British chick named Georgia with a J. He could have made Georgia great? Could have made Georgia, Georgia great again, but she decided <laughs> to pick Georgia. someone else. Who'd she go instead with? Instead of Drizzy Drake. I don't really? know. Somebody that does the same thing as him. She he just laughs. He just laughs at him. He's like, <laughs> oh, is goes, that who he was talking about? You do the same as me? Kendrick can't even bring up Georgia Smith. It's not even close. He doesn't even close to me, dude. Close guess, to what I'm doing. I fuck so many 17 I fuck so many. I'm telling you, Drake's on that R. Kells. Oh, man. When he goes down, that'll be tough. Dude, I'll be sad. guess what his fucking produced? Guess what show he produced? Yeah, Euphoria, Euphoria dude. Yeah, he produced oh. Euphoria. It's like they're all. Yeah, wait a minute. Wait dude, a minute, Kendrick. Wait a minute, Kendrick. Wait a minute, Kendrick. Wait a minute, Kendrick. Did you listen to this? Hold on, Kendrick. <laughs> Shane, did you? Are you the OVO mole? Is it Shane Gillis this whole time? <laughs> Never in my life did I think. That I was gonna say Shane Gillis was the OVO mo, but like, damn nigga, this sounds like J Kendrick's diss tracks. Rifling through it's the air. you are rifling through the air, dude. Tip of the Drizzy Spear, right? Yeah, now, man. unfortunately. Yeah, you didn't want it. When I looked this. up who that, because I was listening to this song and I was like, who the fuck is this about? I looked it up and I was like, he must have wrote this song in two thousand like sixteen. She just turned twenty two. <laughs> This Sorry, year. I'm I was so like, happy. I'm like, what is going on with you? And you're like, well, Drake's a pedophile. That's what I'm dealing with. I'll tell you right what I, what's going on with me. No, I don't like talking about. I don't like talking about what I'm. You're doing. not. You're it not. Makes wrong. me feel gay. Why? What? <laughs> what? A, what a crazy way to end that clip. But nah, nah, nah. I need answers. Do is there a response from Shane after this uh, prediction? Let me know in the comment section, man.